and the charge is underway. Look at Lightning Luke Turnier strike from that number four barrel. Yes, Lightning has struck and he is out of town. Luke Turnier, Heritage Park and the Roadhouse nightclub hit that rail in the lead by three. Darcy Flad and Pure Laders. Look at see Flad comes Jordy Fike and putting the boots to hunger with Golder Associates. And then it's Brian Labake in the veteran and the Mavericks charging in behind. He's about to challenge Jordy Fike for third midway down that backstretch. But up on his right shoulder, yep, there's those yellow shirts. Just what I need. And I got the speed. Y'all got to catch me in the home stretch drive. The louder you cheer, the quicker he'll get here. Luke Turnier sets a blistering pace in this fourth race of the night. Outriders looking good. Nobody going to catch the uncatchable Lightning Luke Turnier tonight. He gets to the wire. Clear the winner by two and a half. Look at this race. Darcy, hang on. Here comes Brian Labacane. Darcy flat. Brian Labacane. And Jordy Fike rolls in to be fourth and a very well-driven and speedy. There's a hole and the charge is underway in a nice start. A very nice start for Roger Moore and Legends and the Primco Dean group, Mike Vegan to the inside. Vern Nolan steals a rail away and Link Douglas to the backside, sorting out the outriders and three wagons across the track. As they go into that first, Mike Vegan, a four-time world outrotting champion, drop back to the outside, three wide, and charging down that back stretch, you'll find Roger Moore, the Primco Dean group, Roger's got company at his left elbow is the great big Lynn BKDI Architects. He is the man with a plan at his eighth GMC Rangeland Derby. Vern Nolan is southbound. BKDI Architects down the lane for home he comes. Look at him open him up another notch. They're not going to catch Vern Nolan tonight. BKDI Architects clear the winner by two and a half. Look at this race. Here comes Roger Moore to take over second. Mike Vegan settles for third. And just inside of him, Lincoln Douglas, Savage Oil Field Reynolds, rolls in. The horn and the charge and a quick one for Captain Kirk Sutherland. Emco off a three and Kelly Sutherland to the outside. Yeah, yeah, Calgary dot adios, buddy. But it's Captain Kirk tonight that steals the rail away from older brother Kelly as they fly into that second turn. Now home stretch, but up on the front end. Beam me up, Scotty. Here comes Captain Kirk. Kirk Sutherland, that is. Emco Corporation and right at his right elbow, he can feel the hot breath of the big wheel team of brother Kelly Sutherland and now he sees others are going at it in the fourth and final turn and in behind them Ray Mitzwing Sandalwood Developments is stalking our leaders look at Kurt Menzmiller he's ducked to the inside and here the Sutherland brothers come the Grand Prairie connection here comes Ray Mitzwing from the outside Kurt Sutherland Kirk opens him up Kelly answers the call is he going to do it no Kirk Sutherland's going to get this one by a horse length Kelly Sutherland Ray Mitzwing Swing and Kurt Benzmiller roll in to be fourth in a well-driven heat number six.